Okay, I'm making a smoked haddock pilaf tonight, so I thought I'd run through the recipe and how to make it because it's kind of quite a nice, uh, different meal. We quite like it. So first of all, you're going to melt down 40 grams of butter in a large-ish kind of saucepan and wait for that to melt. So that's melted. We go, you're going to add uh, two teaspoons, two teaspoons of garam masala. It's this spice here. Just going to give it a good old mix together. You're then going to add nine ounces of rice and mix it in with the butter and the garam masala spice just until everything's coated and mixed thoroughly. On this plate, I've got um, some ginger grated, the zest of a lemon grated, a green chili chopped and de seeded, and a bay leaf. And all of that is going to go in with the rice and the butter and the spices. That's all you need to give it a good mix. Make sure everything's combined. And I'm going to add 13 fluid ounces of chicken stock, and I'm going to give a good um, sprinkling of salt and black pepper to that as well. Now. Okay, that's now how it should look. Just give it a good old mix and. Leave it on the hob for a few minutes just for it to start simmering slightly and then you're going to transfer it to an oven dish with a lid um, so that it can go into the oven. Okay, I've transferred it to my glass dish that has a lid so that I can pop it in the oven but just before I put it into the oven I've got some smoked haddock here that I've been defrosting all day so I'm just going to put that flesh side down so the skin is facing the top on top of the rice. has to be raw, so you know, can't use cooked fish. And the last bit there. Whilst you're waiting for it to cook in the oven, if you just want to boil, hard boil some eggs, um, that needs to be kind of added once it's come out of the oven, so you could be doing that whilst it's in the oven cooking. do now is literally scrape the skin off the top. Yeah, you just literally scrape the skin off of the back of the haddock. Make sure that it all comes off. Okay, once you've taken the skin off the haddock, I will you add um, two or three chopped spring onions and the roughly chopped uh, boiled eggs and you literally just give everything a good mix and the chop up because obviously the haddock needs breaking up as well and just give it all a good mix. I pad quickly for the end of this because the battery's gone on the camera. So you literally just mix everything up. Uh, you can grate the egg into the dish if you wanted smaller pieces, but to be honest, you can kind of get them quite small anyway by just chopping as you mix. And all I've done then is just give it a good squeeze of fresh lemon juice, give it another mix and serve it up.